What's up, people? It's your boy Jatwa. I'm here today in Kerbal Space Program, and today we have a brutal challenge before you. Now, this aircraft is gonna be our version of Quop, one could say, where you have controls you need to manage. You can lift up and back down, back to center. And then similarly, you can adjust everything and then back to center. So, what you are seeing here is all the controls that you need in order to make this airplane aircraft fly. Up front, at least, um, y'all controls a bit more tricky. <laughs> y'all controls a bit more tricky. I can map those out additionally, but I have not yet to six and seven and eight. So for right now, it is one. One lifts our props, uh, our wings up. Two brings us back to down, all the way flat. Three brings us back to neutral. Four alternates one way. Five alternates the other way. And then we go back to center. Okay, so. This should be interesting. Let's see if I can do this. All right. So this is going to be the challenge is to fly this aircraft from here. And let's turn this volume down a bit here on these on the spacecraft. Okay. Accept. Resume flight. So the challenge is going to be to fly from here to the island base and land using these controls by hand. Is this going to be easy? No. Is it going to be hard? Quite. It's going to be a little difficult. It's just going to take some strategic planning when you do this. So you need to make sure that you're doing this the right way because things can go wrong really quickly. Oh crap. Wrong button. Oh! 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 Oh god. <laughs> So yes, things can go very horrible really quickly. You just have to make sure. Oh, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, no 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 no! Oh, no! Okay, I was very close, and there's gonna be a lot of explosions. <laughs> this takes a lot of focus because basically you're controlling the airplane using those buttons there. So let me go back and map out the y'all controls to six, seven, and eight, and hopefully this will get easier. All right, I have remapped everything. Uh, well, not everything. I've mapped out the tail controls. So, six will bring you to the side here. Seven brings you back to neutral. Eight kicks you back to the other side. And then back to seven for neutral. Okay, one brings you up. Two brings you down. Three brings you flat. 4 brings you alternating, 5 brings you other alternating, once again, 3 brings you to flat. Got it? <laughs> Let's try this out and see if I can get this bird airborne. So first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to give myself some, I'm going to lift myself up off the ground and prepare to flatten back out. All right. Am I stressing? Yes, I am. Woo! That was pretty. That was pretty. Okay. All right. So there's nothing to really hold us up. So we're going to have to alternate. And hopefully do this. Oh. oh, one, three, oh. oh, 
four, three, one, one, three, one, one, three. Oh! No! Up! 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 No! We've lost it already! No! Oh my God! All right! All right! That was a lot better. This is a lot better. So the goal, of course, is to fly this over to the island base, and then to land, or just get to the island base. And if you can manage a landing, that's bonus points. I don't know if I'll be able to do this today, because I'm kind of short on time. What do you think, Jeb? Yeah, he's looking at me like, no. Okay, he's got a smile on his face. Let's try this again! Let's try this again. So, that's death count number two. Keep a death count. See how many times it takes you to get over to, to actually get the hang of this craft. And you're trying for the best time and to survive. I am going to set my speeds so that I get an instant rotation. So I'm gonna switch this to eight. Eight, eight, eight. I'm gonna toggle these down to three. This is gonna affect, of course, my overall speeds here, but that's okay. I accept the fact that it's gonna be a lot slower getting to where I wanna go. Adjust it as you see fit. I'm going to adjust this down also to three. And hopefully all these threes will help me out to get this bird into the air. You cannot use the servo controls. You need to use the number keys to do this. So, brakes. Quick save. Alright, here we go. Fly, my pretty, fly! Alright, here we go. With everything set to threes, it should give me smaller controls, instantaneous controls, but also it's going to kick me in the butt because it's going to take me longer to actually commit to my controls. So, let's do this. So far, so good. Alright. So, let's get this over. No, 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 no! No, no! Alright, here we go. We are on our way. We are on our way. We just need to uh, turn ourselves a bit. <gasps> Wrong way. Alright. Nose up, nose up. All right, all right, we're doing good. We're doing good. We're doing good. <gasps> no, no, no. <laughs> no. No. Okay, okay. Slightly terrified. But I think we're doing we're doing fairly okay. No oh, no 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 back to neutral. Oh. So all about feeling out the controls. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. Okay. All right, let's rotate a bit. Okay. Oh no no! Oh, 
fudge knuckles. Okay. Oh. Get me back up. No, back the other way. Up. No, 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 no. Okay. No. 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 Okay. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Okay. All right. It's all. It's very important to zero out your controls. So you hear me jamming on that three. That's to zero out my controls. Everything back to normal. Everything back flat. Okay. So this mod takes Airplanes Plus. It takes in uh, for, well for the mods. This takes Infernal Robotics, Airplanes Plus. Um, I don't think I use any Tweak Scale in this one, uh, but you might want to grab Tweak Scale. I do believe I may have used some Tweak Scale for these joints. So with all those, so Tweak Scale, Infernal Robotics, Airplanes Plus, those are the only three mods you should need. So that being said, is this difficult? Yeah, it's pretty difficult. I had to set it down to three in order to get over here. So the lower you set it, the easier it's going to be. So I mean, we can definitely rank everybody on the level of rotation that they are using. So mine is going to be for the level of three, which we will tenderly call the Buttercup Committee. So for the, I will be hopefully the king of the Buttercups if I can nail a landing. That sounds good to me. I will be king of the buttercups. King. Okay. I need to start figuring out a landing. I have no clue how I'm going to land this thing. I have no clue how I'm going to land this thing. No, no. I meant to hit four. I meant to hit four. I need to start getting myself over. So I can somehow nail a landing. I'm just gonna zero my my throttle and hope and pray that when I get over there, I can just uh, get just enough going. So when I hit the ground, I stay in mostly one piece. <laughs> so here's the rules: using these mods and going you as fast as rotation speed as you can. So just on there, display your rotation speed. And that way we can see what rotation speed you're working with and know where to rank you. And also what you need to do is using only the controls, one through currently, I think it's one through eight right now. Six, seven, eight, or remember all the yaw controls. And uh, one, two is up, down, three, uh, four and five gives you the roll, and three brings you back to neutral. So using only those controls, make it over to here killing my throttle, getting my brakes out, and a lot of prayers, a lot of prayers. All right, here we go, here we go. We're coming down. Coming down nice and easy. No, 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 okay, okay, we need to throttle back up, angle up, angle up, okay, we almost messed that up, throttle up, 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 and let's come around for another touch and go. I got a little scary for a second there. Oh, come back up. Up, 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 up. Nose up, nose up. Nose up! No! No! What 
just happened there? What in the world? What? What is going on? What? We were so close! Oh my god, I've got to try that again so I can be the king of the butterflies. Buttercups. So, yes, I am going to give this another shot over the weekend and hopefully be able to land this monstrosity over on here. I got so close and I panicked. Oh! <laughs> so your goal is to do the same. Fly over using only the number keys. And once you get over, land successfully. Let us know your rotation speed, which you can see here. I will share this on out to Kerbal X and drop the link in to the description. You will be able to show your rotation speeds here. Or you can go to the edit groups and you'll be able to uh, actually tweak them all. So... Yes, that didn't work out too well for me, unfortunately. Okay, uh, I'm just missing a lot of other parts, but normally you can tweak them all here and set all your speeds to show your rotation speeds and also to uh, manage how far your range is on the parts that you want to rotate. So there you go, there is your challenge. This is going to be the Quop Iron Man challenge for Kerbal Space Program. This is not going to be easy. Use those number keys wisely. You should be able to do this. It was pretty easy at three, so definitely challenge yourself to go to a higher level. You can do this. I believe in you. Fly. Land. Crash. <laughs> There's probably going to be a lot of crashing, so just prepare yourselves for a lot of crashing. <laughs>